Hi, I'm Jill Cat with Healthy Facts, and this is a fast, fast dinner. You just need a can of the fat-free refried beans for a time saver. If you have pinto beans, you can also blend them up in your food processor, which I like to do with some cilantro and some cumin. But these are already pre-mixed, and there's no fat or lard or oil. It's just the beans. So for a really, really fast, time-saving sake, I'm going to microwave those. So this is like a seven-layer tostada dinner. And who doesn't like all this yummy Mexican food? You can make these very easily in the oven by um, just you know putting them on, a, on an oven-proof plate at, I don't know, 400 degrees for... I'll put it in the recipe. I'm sure it's not that long. Okay, and then after we put the beans on, we just add our guacamole, green onion, tomato, black olives, and some sour cream. And I'm gonna mix the sour cream in with a little bit of Mexican seasoning, or if you have a taco seasoning. You know, it's the seasoning that makes the food taste delicious. So what? wrong with all of this yummy stuff and a little bit of the the diet cheese blend and we'll be ready for dinner okay I stirred up the beans halfway through the cooking time to make sure they were all nice and warmed through <sighs> Here we go. We need our soup, our guac layer next. Oh man, this is going to be so good. You got to get the guac out to the edges. Then should we do the guac sour cream next? I think so. Mm -mm -mm. So a little bit of green onion, tomato. Oh, I think I was supposed to put the cheese on next. A little bit of cheese. More black olives. There we go. There's our seven layers. Our beans, our cheese, our sour cream, our guac, black olives, tomatoes, green onions, and of course there's mild jalapenos, salsa. What else could we have used? Delish. I'm Jill Cab with Healthy Facts. Thanks for watching. Mmm, that's good.